Greetings, younglings, Padawans, and Jedi Knights. It is I, the Grand Master Jedalo, here to give you another lesson in the ways of the Force. A couple things before we get started. Remember, this channel is on value. It has on the value for value model. So, if you've got any type of value from this, please give something of value back, whether it be your time, your talent, or your treasure. More on that in the description below. Uh, don't know if the YouTube subscriber purge is still going on, so make sure you're still subscribed to this channel. And uh, if you're not, uh, please resubscribe. And if this is your first time watching, go ahead and hit that sub button. It's free. It costs you nothing. Helps me out and gives you lovely people something to watch. So, uh, yeah, let's get into this. So, I'm going to show you where that emblem key goes. We're going to start off by doing that. Here, Let's keep going this way. Doorknob has been repaired. And this is the emblem key. No further use for the key. Discard, yes. Make a trip to the box, drop some stuff off. Sword key? I don't think no, I think we use a sword key already. What's use helmet key. Okay. Last place for the helmet key. you want to do is push this. Don't go in there because you'll you'll be booby trapped. 
push this. when those doors start moving, but don't worry, it's fine. Now what you want to do, because you run faster without a weapon, you want to unequip that. This makes you run faster. And it's, and there's a switch on the wall here now. You'll see why I did that, why I unequipped the, the, sh the shotgun to make me run faster. running and trying to beat that if you're still holding your weapon. So I advise uh, unequipping your weapon for that. The book. Last book, volume one. Okay, so the last book had the wolf on the back. This one is the eagle. This is your eagle emblem. See? There you go. Alright. Book. November 29th, 1967. I can't get out. I have tried every possible way to escape, but only to be faced with the reality that I'm trapped. I've been everywhere. The laboratory with the large glass tubes filled with formaldehyde, uh, formaldehyde, I think that's how you say it, formaldehyde, and those dark, wet, and eerie caves. What can I do? At first, I didn't want to believe my eyes, but that familiar high-heeled shoe in the corridor, it was like, it was like reflex. One name came to mind, Jessica. I don't want to believe they share the same fate as me. No. I can't give up hope. I have to hope they're alive. November 30th, 1967. I haven't had anything to eat or drink for the past few days. I feel like I'm going crazy. Why is this happening to me? Why do I have to die like this? I was too obsessed with designing this ghastly mansion. I should have known better. November 31st, 1967. It was a dark and damp underground tunnel on another dead end, but even in the darkness, something caught my eye. Carefully, I lit the last match I had to see what it was. A grave, but deeply engraved into the stone was my name, George Trevor. At that instant, it all became clear to me. Those bastards knew from the beginning that I'd die here, and I fell right into their trap. But it's too late now. I'm losing it. Everything is becoming so far away. Jessica, Lisa, forgive me. Because of my ego, I got both of you involved in this whole damn conspiracy. Forgive me. May God justify my death in exchange for your safety. George Trevor. Name is carved into the small gravestone. George Trevor. There's a switch. Press it. Yes, and if George had pressed the button, there's a ladder. Salvation! Okay, where's my shotgun? It's gonna need it. Salvation! Ooh, giant spatter! Dead. This way. Do your right. Another box of ammo. Got Twelve bullets. Got more ammo for the killing. Oh shit! Bye. Keep that. Monsters. 
zombies coming. Come on, zombie. Come on, zombie. Come on. There you go. Oh, he's dead. Come on, zombie. Come on, zombie. Here comes zombie. Dead. Okay, there's dagger here. Take the dagger. Reload the gun. This is on B. Turn around there, Jill. This is on B. Blow off his head. He's dead. Yes. He's dead. That. That. We're zombie. Here's zombie. There he is. Hi, zombie. done in here. Box first. All right. 
So, I'm gonna put away this. You want to head like you're going back to the residence, but you're not going back to the residence. Gotta stand, gotta stand like right up on this thing. There we go. Come on. Come on, you stupid thing. There we go. The sound of the waterfall seems to have stopped. Okay, 
this door first. Is uh, handgun ammo. So if you're playing this and you're using the handgun and you're low on handgun ammo, grab this. Or you want, I'll grab it to show sure you guys what it is. See? Handgun ammo. I won't take it though. Because I, I don't need it. But that's what it is. I just wanted to show you guys that's what it is. So in case you're playing this and you're using the handgun ammo, at this, the handgun at this point, you're low on handgun ammo, you got that you can grab. Is that you, Jill? Is that voice Enrico's? Yeah. You're alive! Stop! Are you with anybody, Jill? No, but why? <clears throat> the stars are finished. Someone is a traitor. Umbrella set us up. <laughs> well, I got shot. Rico! Traitor? Who? Whoever did this is definitely a professional. Wait, he's holding something. So we'll need this crank too. Alright. do is you want to put this away we don't need this one anymore the green handle this one you need and that you need don't need this right now yes. Yes, away. you will however um will we need the shotgun you know what, we can put the shotgun away, because we're going to need something else. Right there. This.
that we can actually that we can actually put in the place of the shotgun. Actually, take that. It's gonna hold here, so that's for this crap. Indiana Jones moment here. see why here in just a moment. Shotgun. Make sure, make sure that the that the culprit is dead. Oh wait, never mind. No, okay, never mind. You're just wasting shots that way. So don't 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 do that. Oh, never mind. Here's. So now you want to equip your knife. There's a knife over here. That's what this glowing thing is. See? It's the same thing. But if you kept your knife and you remember to take it with you at this point, you had it with you at the beginning of the game, you don't need to take that. Because get it from the box. The webbing. And go through. you need is right here. So. Through the door. Alright, so where does this take Okay, we're at this point. But you know what? I think we are going to do that next time. That'll be for next... That'll be the next session. We'll go do that. We're going to go save and, and end. We'll just go back the way we came. We'll go end and we're going to save. That's what we'll start next time, though. So, right back. Oh, you know what? I'll just go where I was, and I'll save it off, off, 
video. I think that's what I'll do. <laughs> Derp! So I'll just tell you... Forget what I just said, I'll save it off video. And then I'll just go back here when I stay. Well, you know what? Fuck it. Because then, you know, I might put some stuff away and you might not see me putting the stuff away. I just realized. Never mind. Going with the original plan. <laughs> Sorry. Forget everything I just said. Going with the original plan. You'll see me save on camera. I mean, on in, on video. On, ca on camera, on video, same thing. Because I don't know how you're playing this. You might be playing this different than I am, especially if this is your first time and you're watching this as a, as a walkthrough, a playthrough. So, yeah. That's why I'm doing stuff like this. All right, take the ink ribbon writer. We'll save our progress. Yes. Right. Yes. All righty, we have just saved Padawan, so this is where we're going to end the video for this week. Uh, I'll be back next week, or tune in next week to see the more of the underground. I'll be finishing the underground next week and going into the laboratory. Next week we'll be probably finish. We'll be at least finishing the underground, underground, and uh, uh, final confrontation with Lisa Trevor. We're definitely going to do that. Probably get into a little bit of the laboratory, possibly. But yeah, that's for next week. So until then, my younglings and Padawans, remember. The Force will be with you. Always. Greetings, Padawans. I'm Commander Corvair of the Rebellion. The Landmaster has requested me to convey some important information to you all. He requested that you check out his Patreon page at www.patreon.com slash general to see all the bonus content and behind the scenes action you could receive when pledging to help his channel. All proceedings he receives from his Patreon will be used to help fund future machines such as Green Pass and Crew. Along with a possible cup of blue milk. And to finally defeat that uncharismatic tyrant, the severe asthma.